to the frame. All right, that's about where you need to be. Actually, a little bit more in. Okay. Now, do whatever you're going to do. Okay. Welcome to my art studio. I would like to share with you what I'm currently working on. It's the latest painting that I'm working on. Whoa, so, that's redundant. Let me show you the thing I'm working on. This is the thing I'm working on. Okay. <laughs> Welcome to my art studio. This is the, la the latest painting I'm working on. As you can see, it's a evening seaside. My idea behind this painting was, I was recently Googling dragonflies and I thought how beautiful they are. They are. And so some of them were flying over a pond and I thought I will paint dragonflies flying over a, like a, like over water, but not necessarily over a pond, over something that they might not fly, for example, an ocean. So I thought, why don't I paint opposites, an ocean and a dragonfly in the same painting? And so what you see here is an evening, seaside, well, night. And I'm going to have dragonflies flying over the water towards the moonlight. I thought that I will incorporate some of the flowers, which you might not see them close to the beach, you know, shore but I still thought that I will paint an odd <clears throat> few colors into my painting. So I think I'm pretty much done with the water. I still have to work on, um, you know, like the, the, the current of the water coming to the shore, just adding a little bit more of foamy kind of like waves. And then I will move on to paint some of these flowers right here. And the last thing I will do is I will paint the dragonflies flying as if from the shore over the water towards the moon so that's my idea for this painting i decided to name this painting i would like to share with you an idea that i just came up to incorporate into my home interior design this is my handbag this handbag is about 19 years old if i'm not mistaken my husband bought it for me back in time when our child was about three to four years old in belgium this handbag went with me all over Europe. It's still new because I didn't wear it that frequently. I do not wear it nowadays, so I decided why don't I incorporate it into my interior design. I put it on a bookshelf, place some books in it, and looky how it looks amazing. I in my library. I think I have a pretty good collection of red leather bound books. I think it looks good. My handbag has a new life. I like to show you my fresh flowers. I always have fresh flowers in the house. I do have another hobby and it is collecting small vases. I love going to antique shops over the weekends and just look around for a new little vase that will speak to my heart. I uh, buy it, bring it home. I don't know how many I have by now, but I do have many. And what I do with the small vases is, as you can see, in the tall vase, I have fresh flowers, and when they begin withering, I'll cut them in, um, I don't know, short and place them in a small vase. That way, I extend their flower's life, and I can have these flowers stay in their vases fresh like that for about four weeks. <laughs> 